In Cork, thousands of people have turned out to greet the WBO super middleweight champion Steve Collins, who successfully defended his title against Chris Eubank at Parky Cleave on Saturday night. This evening, the cameraman was given a civic reception by Cork Corporation. Steve Collins is ready to adopt Cork as his second home. It was here he made his international boxing debut, won his world title and successfully defended it at the weekend. Well used to welcoming home its heroes, Cork reserved a special welcome for the Celtic warrior. Well, I'm on top of the world now. It's great. I'm in a great situation. I've got a, the future is is uh, bright ahead of me, and I'm looking forward to my next fight. With the strains of the mass bands filling the evening air, the victory cavalcade headed for City Hall. The champion was cheered to the echo in the county and city where his family has its roots. We're going to make him an honorary Corkman, and he's getting his papers tonight. He's getting his honorary papers tonight. Uh, he has great affection for Cork. The support of the people of Cork from the very start of his career uh, has been absolutely magnificent. I think he's very conscious of that. We're very proud that he's proud of Cork and that uh, we're going to be behind him now and in all future fights. The Collins bandwagon has been good for the morale and business life of Cork, but like his fight on Saturday, the champion knew just how it was going to turn out even seven years ago. I think it was back in 1988. I came back from America, took a couple of weeks holiday in school in County Cork and uh, I remember coming home, we stopped off at the Michael Collins Museum and there's a, a guest book there and I signed it and I wrote down Future World's Champ, so um, that book is probably still there, so someone just goes back a couple of years and see it's on it. You know.